is a uh, our cup of it. It's a kind of 50-50 because sometimes, sometimes the judge alone might can make the decision. You're going to need the help of the jury. And same thing, vice versa, the jury alone might can make the decision. No. Because for the culture of this, this country, it wouldn't be fair because, because of the fact that you don't know who the judge is affiliated to. You don't know who, who, who they, they know. So it would be much better for us to have the normal 12. Yes, I am in favor of judge alone trial. Why? It, the, I've seen where, based on evidence, a lot of people, well, I told you my background, a lot of people were guilty and the jury let them go. I know of even of an instance where the judge was so convinced that he banned a jury for, banned a jury for life when they came in with a non-guilty non verdict. So I think that um, it better have professional people. This thing that, that way you're tried by your peers, not good enough. Trinidad is too small for that. That would be a bad idea. You see, because they would make him, he would be so responsible to give decisions that he's not good. Mm. Yes, and so let's spread it across the border and give people a fair, like a fair trial. I, I don't agree with a judge alone trial, all right? Because I find people supposed to be judged by the peers, right? Because uh, we are human, and uh, human nature, we could choose uh, for, you know, depending on how the wind blow, right? So here what? Trial by your peers. You might not really get a fair, fair trial. Because so much of the judge might have in his mind, you know, about the criminal thing. So you know, sometimes he watch and he judge over there. He judge by your, your look alone. So sometimes he might need to get a fair trial. He might just look at the, the appearance, and then he say he guilty. You know, they went and listen to his story and hear you know the life that he went through before to where he is now. Yeah.